fine form if that last game's got anything to go by they showed themselves really in a terrific light to win and they do the same again well, you'd fancy them too i'm sure the manager wouldn't have had too much to say in between these two matches full of confidence this side and this is the 11 that will take the field for middlesbrough so alan 442 yeah i think it looks that way martin yes it's the conventional shape it's the one that the manager prefers Check for you on the Leeds United lineup. Probably one of the two front men will slip behind the other and, and augment the midfield when required. I think so. If they start getting overloaded in the middle of the park, that's always an option for this manager. Real chance. He's in here. Well, they've all gone to the defender to say, well done. But I think the guy who had the chance really should have scored. Well, he had the chance to uh, get his shot away, even though he had to take it quickly. Should have done better back here's Phillips here's a chance to attack just the keeper to beat oh saved by the goalkeeper at full stretch and here's a corner to come for Leeds corner swung in great header great save Oh, nothing wrong with that, was that? I thought he was going to score with a header, but top keeping. Baker. Johnson anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. It's looking good, this move. And they've cut it out. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Good challenge. Braithwaite. Can John stop? That's John. Johnny House. Please make your way to the ticket office. Have your a space to go forward into with the ball. Well, he could go for goal from here. The goalkeeper's ball. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Baker. Thanks to the referee. Middlesbrough play on the advantage law. Pereira da Silva. Proper tackle that. Here's Phillips. from him with the tackle Braithwaite intercepted well well he's pressed 
him there to running the ball out of play. He's gone back, the referee, to book the offender. He let the play go, and it was good work by the official, but he's quite entitled to book the player now. Well, he's always going to get a yellow for that, wasn't it? It was a silly challenge, and uh, yes, you play advantage, but he's got to be punished for it. Keeper's ball, no question about that. It's a weak cross, really. Johnny Housen. Good forward play from them. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. Leeds United looking for a victory here. But it's not going to be easy. Pablo Hernandez. Tackle here. To Johnson moving the opposition around with their play at these two players and the slide tackle very successfully done and that's gone out for a corner for Middlesbrough and here comes the corner and they get it away Daniel Ayala and it's Middlesbrough the shot's on wonderful save and now he's going to sort out that earlier incident and put the player who committed the foul. Yeah, he doesn't miss much, this ref, he's, he's eager. The header on target, but never looking as though it was going to get the better of this goalkeeper. No, he's under a bit of pressure to head the ball and uh, didn't really get the direction at all on it. Luke Ayling. Wants to get at him and he's got past him. Put into the middle. Good defensive clearance there. Now that's a throw. Samuel Seiss. Trying to stretch the opposition using the wider areas here. Supporting player alongside. Put in from the wide area. There's still danger here. And they've scored! And the first goal will be such a boost to them. He followed his instincts, he followed the play in. And then he followed, watching the ball into the net. Yeah, lesson for any schoolboy, just to make sure you follow shots in, that you're in that danger area. Now, this looks promising. Johnny House. I know this manager's not too keen on this kind of play. Uh, he'd rather the ball was in the other half, and they were playing their football in the opposing half. Luke Ayling. Phillips. I would guess in this possession play here, they're trying to get the opposition to come out and hurry them and maybe then pass their way through them. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition now they're here. Looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. They've lost the ball and the counter-attack could be there. Well, the referee is... the kickoff here for the second half. Baker. Ferreira de Silva. Fabio. Well, they're in a good position here. Makes a challenge here. Samuel Seiss. Baker. Here's a chance to move forward from midfield after that interception. Luke Ayling. This could lead to a chance. It's good attacking play. And shoots! And that shot's blocked very quickly. Baker. Ferreira da Silva. I think that's a good performance, isn't it, Alan, from him in the first half? 
Yeah, and what a good time to score that was. Uh, put his side in the lead. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. Johnny Housen. Now the shot. Very good stop here. Well, they're a goal down, but they've got this corner. Not able to take full advantage of a good position. Well, we've got an angle on this uh, offside call, Alan. I must say, it is the most difficult thing in all the officiating, I think. But this assistant has got eagle eyes. Well, I certainly wouldn't want to do that job because uh, the uh, speed that players move now, as it turns out, what a great call. Played forward, a bit of menace in this attack. Chance to go at the opposition with pace. It's a good place to win the ball here. Chance. Good stop by the goalkeeper. Well, this goalkeeper looks absolutely determined to keep this clean sheet of his. What a save. And he's knocked it out of play, the defender. Fabio. Baker. Space for the shot. Wonderful finish. Anyway, the goalkeeper didn't see it, but he didn't react, and on and on.